Before we start this week's video, I just want to give two quick shout outs and show you a new product. This, this t-shirt is from Foundry Co. Now they're local to me, they're, they're quite a big part of Sheffield Dubs as well. I, you always see their cars on stands or even now, which is quite cool, you see them with their own stand. There was at Fjord. Yeah, Fjord, I saw uh, a few of their cars at Fjord. And I bought this, this isn't like a paid thing, like I bought this and I bought another one. I bought the sand one because it looks sick. And they are really good. So I'll leave them downstairs. <laughs> down, down in the description. Go check them out. Show them a bit of love. And just check it out. It's, it's nice quality. And I like the box logos. Also, next one. Creative Hitch. We've got some new stickers in. And they're made by Creative Hitch. And there's something on my shoulder. So that's just fluff. No worries. Barnet's still shit, as you'll notice. But we've got a new sticker and I'm going to put it on now and I'm going to show you. I've taken ours off, I'll show you the residue. Now I know that's not me because I'm not a, a young man from Essex and my stickers flew away. But no residue from the old one, from the old OG style. And uh, sorry Adam if you're watching this, but I did copy this style and you're going to see it now. Now it's got to be said, my car is filthy and for one thing I hate putting stickers on because it never goes right for me. But for the first time in existence, 621. And that is our new sticker. You can see the reflection. We'll see how the gap. Yeah. I'll take you this side. You might be able to see a nice little tree. But that's our new sticker. They look quite sick. Well, I say quite sick, they look absolutely and those. So if you need stickers for your club brand, check out Creative Hitch. We showed some of their air freshers before and he also gave me a free air freshener, which is nice. But we've got three of these. We've got a big black one, very limited. I want to do more though, because look at it, it's sick. I've got one of them. Not only that, but we have got some large white ones, same exact style, same exact size, but in white, and also some little white ones. So I'm going to put them up on the store, and I want you to leave a like if you want to buy one. If you want one immediately, and they're not on the store, you can check in the description, the, the store's linked there. But if for whatever reason they aren't on there, let me know on Instagram, like follow me, or even just, if you just direct message me, you don't have to follow. Uh, I'll get back to you and I'll sort you out. So feel free to enjoy the video. Right, what's going on? Welcome back. And another Wednesday, another shitty hairdo from Jack. Beard's still shit, don't worry about it. You see the title, we're doing. What are we doing, idiot? A splitter mod. An aerial, we know we're doing we're not doing an aerial, they've got an aerial on. Basically, we're doing some sort of excuse for aero, aero the dynamic. Aero dynamic. Basically, we're doing a uh, custom built front splitter made of marine grade plywood. Now, he's behind me. Uh, Elliot was gonna put it, but he's sort of like given up with the idea. So, I've taken on the project, the kind friend I am, I've taken it off his hands. And currently we have my front bumper off. The orangutan is doing whatever over there. It's not my job, it's our job. Do you think Jeremy Clarkson tells off the cameramen because they're not driving enough cars? They don't, do they? Excuse the mad breeze blowing from his barnet, but basically the plan for today is we're gonna, we've taken my old bumper off, taken the Vagroots one off. I do like the Vagroots one, it's just not deep enough for me. And we all know we like it deep. So we're gonna lay the split it down, we've taken the Vagroots one off and we're gonna mark it up where we're gonna cut it and see how shit we can make it look. Cause it's not really modifying your car if you don't insult someone in there, is it really? Vagroots one is off. What video was it? What video was it when I said you've drawn your helmet? What video was that? I can't remember, I think it might have been MOT. No, you US light mod. That was the same day. Right. Well, yeah, this is the helmet has progressed. It's now my helmet. My helmet is much smaller than this. Don't worry about that. So we've just finished cutting it out. As you can see there, I did put some videos in. We've got the sander. That's done. We've got it more or less level. It's never going to be perfect, is it? But we're now going to bolt it in and then get it fitted to the car. And then I've got them, you know, them little um, like splitter rods that stance kids use. Well, I like them, so I'm putting them in. And this is the test fit. 
So it still needs a bit more like paint on it. I'll sort that out in a minute. Right, so we've got it all on and I'm pretty pretty happy with it. I'll just walk you over to it now. There's a the new Lexus. Elliot Smith's new whip. Yeah, I like it. I'll show you some more angles of it now. So that was it. I had to cut it short because uh, Elliot and his missus were going out. I got left in the house to look after it. And there she is. My hands are still a little bit dirty from actually doing some work, to be fair. Uh, what happened was, I didn't video any of it because I was, I was the only one doing it. But basically, this, this left corner, if you're looking at it dead on, like, it was a bit skew with, so I had to shave it down and trim it down a bit. So tell me what you think down in the comments. Uh, let me know, because I've had a few people say it's shit, a few people are saying ruin the car. You can understand, people. These cars have two followings, don't they? They have the idiots like me who have them, and then they have like the people who want to keep them OEM, which is fair enough. Uh, but I just, while I have it, I want to do something a bit mad to it, and this is the start of that, I'll say. So if you did enjoy it, please leave a like, drop a comment down below, subscribe, check out Foundry Crow, like I said earlier, check out our new stickers. Obviously, I've put the one on here, and I need some cars to put them on to take the picture, to take pictures of, and to get them on the site. So if you're interested in being that car, let me know and I'll chuck you a discount in exchange for you taking a nice picture of it. So that's it. Let me know what you think of the splitter. Follow Foundry Code, Great Bitch, me. I'll catch you in the next one. We can be heroes everywhere we go.